Hey folks, I'm Bethany with the Barazza support team. Today I'm going to be walking you through making grind adjustments using the Encore Conical Burr Grinder. The Encore has 40 grind settings that range from fine to coarse, but how do you know where to start? We're asked this question pretty frequently in support, and while we do have suggestions for starting points, experimentation is key. This is when making coffee at home can be super fun. Because coffee is an agricultural product, there are a few different variables that come into play when choosing your grind setting. Variables such as the coffee, your brewing method, and the water temperature can all play a part in this. Today we're going to be focusing on how the roast profile of your coffee can influence your grind. I'm going to be grinding two coffees for V60 using the Encore with a single dose hopper. This combo is perfect for experimentation and exploration of different coffees without the hassle of emptying an entire hopper each time you want to switch over. You can measure exactly what you need for your specific brewing method using the lid, then pour directly into your grinder. All right, let's talk coffee. Today we have Onyx's Southern Weather, a washed Colombian and Ethiopian blend, and Brandywine's Las Layas, a Costa Rican black honey processed coffee. These are both great examples of a dark roast and a light roast. Before we begin, I want to note that it's important to make sure your grinder is turned on before making grind adjustments, particularly when adjusting finer. This helps reduce stress on your burr holder and adjustment ring. Think of this like changing gears on a bike while riding uphill. There's tension on the system, so you want to have everything moving as you make adjustments. When grinding your coffee for pour over using the Encore, I find that a good starting point is somewhere within a grind range of 15 and 20. For Southern Weather, I'll be using setting 19. This coffee is going to lean more coarse on our grind range. Because the roast time is extended when achieving a dark roast, these coffees will have a lower moisture content overall, causing them to be more brittle. Using a coarser grind size means your water has less surface area to interact with during extraction and your coffee will taste less bitter than if you ground on a finer setting. For Las Layas, I'll be using setting 15, which puts us on the finer end of our grind range. Because this coffee spent a shorter amount of time roasting, its roast profile is much lighter in comparison to Southern Weather. Light roasted coffees will have higher moisture content and you'll find that they will be more dense overall. A finer grind size increases the surface area of your coffee, which in turn increases solubility during the extraction. Your palate truly is your best tool when making grind adjustments. If your coffee is tasting bitter and taking longer to draw down, consider coarsening your grind. If your coffee is tasting sour and drawing down more quickly, consider tightening your grind. Experimentation is your friend, and don't be afraid to venture away from our suggested grind settings or your preferred recipe next time you brew your coffee. Thanks for watching.